Okay, the closed gloving process is got a few more steps to it, but in all honesty, it's not really that much more difficult. Your hands are going to be already in your gown. You want to make sure your fingers don't peek out the top, so keep them nice and neat inside. You're going to be able to use your fingers like little claw clamps. The entire glove is technically sterile at this point. So you can go ahead and pick up this part, the very base of it. You're going to lay the glove on top of your hand. Okay, I'm going to show you real quick where my hand is inside here. It looks like this. And I'm going to put my hand back in. Don't do that for real. So I'm placing my glove on my hand where it's your palm of the glove to the palm of my hand, the thumb of the glove, goes to the thumb of my hand, and the fingers are going to point towards me. So if you remember that way to line up your gloves, you will always be able to put them on the correct hand the right way. I'm going to have to take my fingers and put a little clamp right here. So can you guys see that? How I'm pinching off that one side? Then I'm going to take the outer edge with this hand and bring it all the way over the top. Now, this takes a little bit of wiggling. Now, if you look, I have now put my fingers in the wrong spaces. This is not a time to panic. All you have to do is bring things over the right way. And sometimes it works better than others. Okay, if you cannot do that that easily in the beginning, you have to wait until you get your other glove on. So my hand is out. I'm not worrying about anything else at the moment. I just want to get my other glove on. So at this point, I'm picking it up again. Palm to palm, thumb to thumb. Fingers are pointing towards me. I'm going to take my finger, clamp off that front edge of my glove, and I'm going to pick up over and bring my hand in there. Okay. Now, you just fuss with it until you get your fingers into place. Okay, you can adjust. You want to keep your cuff inside your glove. All right, if you accidentally pull your cuff out, you have to start over. If you rip your gloves, you have to start over also. 